I'm going to make a spiced rack of lamb with a pomegranate syrup sauce. It's a really lovely recipe and that sweet pomegranate syrup dressing just is such a wonderful pairing with the spices. I'm going to dry toast some cumin seeds and also some coriander seeds. It's called tempering. We're just going to really bring out the natural oils and the whole seeds. Wonderful aroma coming out of them. That's when you know they're done. So just take them off the heat into a pestle and mortar. Just going to grind them down. And think about having them ground down quite finely because you don't want a big bit of whole seed when you're eating it. But a little bit of texture is actually really nice. That's great. Then we go in with turmeric, ground ginger, ground cumin. Gives you a different earthiness even though you've got cumin in there twice. Ground cinnamon, a little bit of a hit from cayenne pepper. And then just a pinch of nutmeg. And with some oil, about five tablespoons. Just give everything a good mix. You want a paste. Right. Bring that beautiful piece of lamb up here. Now I've got enough paste in here to do two racks of lamb, but we're just going to do one right now. Take enough of it and rub it into the lamb. There we go. I'm just going to wash my hands because I've been handling raw meat. Okay, now I'm going to sear the lamb, so I'm just going to turn my pan on. You don't want it too high, you don't want to burn the meat or the spices. You just want to form a nice crust, so medium heat. Now you've got oil on the lamb already, so you don't need to put oil in there and it won't have all that spatter. All you want to do is just make sure you brown every exposed side possible to get a nice golden crust on it to give it a head start before you pop it in the oven. I'm just going to flip the lamb over. You see, it's got a wonderful deep colour. That's just what you want. And that's also the spices there, so it's not the lamb burning. Then carefully, get it on its side. And again, on the other side. Then we're going to lift it, put it in the oven pan. Turn this off. Okay, that's it. I'm just going to pop it in the oven on 200 degrees for 15 minutes. use that juice that's in the pan. That's it. That way we don't waste any of that wonderful flavour of the spices in the lamb whilst it was cooking. We want to let the lamb rest so I'm just going to cover it with a little bit of foil just to help keep it warm while it becomes nice and moist and tender. Now I'm going to start the sauce. I've got a gentle medium heat to make my pomegranate sauce. I've got some pomegranate juice here, clear honey, a little bit of sweetness to counter that sharp flavour of the pomegranate. Got some balsamic vinegar and lastly the ingredient, pomegranate molasses. Pomegranate molasses is just 100% concentrated pomegranate juice. It's incredibly sour and yet sweet at the same time. Now because you've got honey in here you want to make sure you're mixing everything well prevent the honey from sticking to the bottom of the pan and burning. It's bubbling nicely, you want it to reduce a bit. Bring over my lamb now. Beautiful. I think it's nice to take a couple of the chops off the rack and then serve the rest of the rack whole. It just looks really, really lovely. I'm going to spoon, gather some of that lovely, rich, Sauce, and then just drizzle it everywhere. And here we have my spiced rack of lamb with pomegranate sauce. Absolutely delicious.